my last video I showed you how to make falafel in the air fryer. I hope you enjoyed watching it and making it as well. Today I bought two huge eggplant and I wanted to roast it in the air fryer. I'm going to show you how to roast them in two different ways. One, I'm going to show you how to roast the whole eggplant with skin inside the air fryer. And the other one, I'm going to show you how to roast it differently if you're unable to fit the whole eggplant inside the air fryer. If you're a beginner just learning to cook and new to air fryer recipes, you have come to the right place. I have plenty of air fryer recipes in my channel and I'm going to drop all those recipe link in the description below, so do check it out. I'm also going to be sharing some tips, so keep watching until the end and let's get started. Welcome to Shine with Shoops. This channel is all about making you shine with my healthy diet and building your emotional strength. So make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss any new updates from me. I bought two big eggplants from the farmer's market. If you remember, I used similar size to make masala eggplant parmesan. This is great to make a variety of dishes. Make sure to wash and dry. You can prick using a fork or use a knife to make slits into the eggplant. Just like this, four slits around the eggplant. This will help to roast evenly. Make sure to consume this vegetable soon after buying. You can store it in the fridge up to four to five days. After making slits, brush oil all over the eggplant. I'm using avocado oil. You may use any oil of your choice. Applying oil will give a richer toasty flavor. It will also eliminate the raw flavor, nice and shining, ready to be air fried. I'm preheating the air fryer for 4 minutes under 375 degree Fahrenheit. Once it's preheated, just watch what happens. When I try to keep both the eggplants inside the basket, these two fit inside the air fryer basket but as I close the basket one of the eggplant is too big and many of you may encounter this problem so I will show you what to do. In the first method put the whole eggplant with skin make slits as I showed earlier and keep it inside the basket air fry for 15 minutes under 390 degree Fahrenheit. Let's see how this turns out. You can see how the eggplant is starting to roast. If the eggplant is small, 15 minutes will be sufficient. Since the size is huge, it will need more time. Using a tong, you can see that it needs to be roasted a little bit more. So I'm going to air fry for five more minutes under 390 degree Fahrenheit. Now let's see, this is beautifully roasted. See how the skin is charred? I'm turning the eggplant so you can see how it has been roasted. Wonderfully done in the air fryer. Keep it aside for five minutes to rest. Let it cool down a bit. You'll see how the skin is all wrinkly. Using a knife, carefully cut it through and open. Wow! Look at this beauty. Be very careful when the hot steam gets out. I'm totally in love with this. So happy to see how beautifully it got roasted in the air fryer. Look how the skin easily peels off. This is how it should be peeling off. This shows that the eggplant is roasted well. Use a knife or spoon to help remove the roasted eggplant from the skin. Did you know that eggplant has antioxidants like vitamin A and C which helps protect your cells against damage? You can make dip out of roasted eggplant, papa ganoush and in India a traditional dish called bangan ka bharta. That's what I'm showing you in my next video. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do and stay tuned for that upcoming recipe. This looks great. Now moving on to the second method. 
if the eggplant is huge and don't fit in the air fryer, don't worry. Just cut it in four parts and keep it inside the air fryer basket. Brush the eggplant lightly with oil. Then cut it into four parts so that it fits inside the air fryer basket depending upon the size of the basket. Cut them into small or big pieces. I'm using Gourmia air fryer. Air fry for 20 minutes under 390 degree Fahrenheit. After 20 minutes, nicely roast it with the same grilled charred texture. If the top portion is too brown, just discard a little bit. The skin will peel off easily. These two ways of roasting can be easily used to make a variety of dishes. This beautiful vegetable has so many different names. Eggplant, aubergine, bangan, katrika. So many different names in so many different parts of the world. They call it differently. But this beautiful vegetable, when it's roasted, tastes absolutely delicious. In my next video, I'm going to show you how to make air fried bangan bartha. So stay tuned for that. If you haven't subscribed yet, please give a thumbs up and subscribe to support this channel. Stay tuned for another exciting recipe and don't forget to shine with shows.